For Huang Xiaoling, owning a car once seemed impossible. She couldn't afford one. But the release of this mini electric model changed that. It costs around $5,000, one-fifth the price of the average car here. The 25-year-old graduate says she didn't hesitate to buy one. The cost is really low, and the whole country is being encouraged to protect the environment by going electric, so I decided to buy it. Unlike most electric vehicles, this car can be plugged into a normal 220-volt outlet. It's made by local car maker Wu Ling and has overtaken Tesla as the top-selling electric vehicle in China. The brand is a joint venture with General Motors to target younger consumers and less affluent drivers. It's a huge, untapped market in China. We are redefining the concept of new energy cars. They are no longer just expensive and luxurious. In the southern city of Liuzhou, electric vehicles are a common sight. China's leaders say cities like this are leading the way. Beijing wants electric vehicles to make up 20% of all car sales in China by 2025, 50% by 2035. About 30,000 of these mini electric cars are produced every month. For now, the manufacturer is focusing on Chinese consumers, but they've set their sights on the markets of other developing countries in Southeast Asia. Most of the world's electric vehicles are made in China. Preferential government policies have helped stoke demand here. But the overseas market holds huge potential for Chinese car makers. It's very possible that Chinese electric cars will become mainstream in the global market. We have very strong supply chain and the cost is very low. Chinese electric cars offer a high value option for consumers as we enter the electric or AI era. The high end or luxury market, however, remains dominated by Western brands. Audi and BMW have expanded their new energy efficient offerings while Tesla is ramping up production capacity. It aims to produce more than half a million cars in Shanghai next year, thousands of which will be exported to Europe. For now, cheaper electric vehicles are leading the way in China. Huang Xiaoling knows her mini electric car isn't for everyone, but with a short daily commute, she says it's more than enough. Katrina Yu, Al Jazeera, Liuzhou City, China.